Today I want to talk to you about the quick and easy way, especially for you people out there that are lazy like I am, to solve any two-step equation without doing a bunch of steps and operations. So let's take an example. 2x minus 9 equals 31. Now in your class you've probably been taught, oh, We've got to eliminate the 9 and then divide by whatever this number is, simplify, and we get our number. I want to skip all that, right? I'm a big fan of patterns and shortcuts and speed. And so what I'm about to show you here cuts through all the formulas and the operations and just gives you one formula for any two-step equation that's in this format. So it goes like this, AX equal or plus B, right, plus B. equals c. x can be any variable, a through z, excluding e and i because those are specially reserved letters. a, b, and c are all numbers. So I, I like to go one level up and get more abstract so you can figure out these shortcuts. The formula, by the way, to solve any two-step equation without going through a bunch of operations is this. Your variable, which in this case is x, equals the quantity C minus B all over A. So if you write things down or put it in Evernote, I want you to drill this formula in your head. What I want your brain to do is say anytime you see, and this plus can be a minus by the way, a AX plus or minus B equals C. Whenever you see that format, you can immediately jump to the shortcut formula here. So let's Let's try this and then we'll check our work. So A, in this case, is 2. B is negative 9. And C, on the other side of the equal sign, is 31. So let's take these three, these three values and plug it into this formula. So X equals the quantity C, which is 31, minus negative 9, which is B, all over A, which is 2. Double negatives turn into a positive. So really what this says is X equals 31 plus 9, all over 2. So double negatives turn into a positive for this problem. X equals 40 over 2. And finally x equals 20. See how fast that was? We didn't have to do, oh, we subtract one thing and then we got to divide by another and simplify. We simply pick off our three values, in this case, a, b, and c, plug it into this formula, and we got our answer. But I don't want you to take my word for it. Let's test my theory and see if I'm telling the truth or if I'm full of hot air. So if this is true, then we should be able to plug this in here and it should tie to 31. So we take, we take 2 times 20, which was our x value, minus 9. I'm going to put a question mark because we don't know if I'm telling the truth or I'm full of hot air. 2 times 20 is 40, minus 9, question mark, 31. We're still testing the theory. 40 minus 9 is... 31. Beautiful. 31 equals 31. So to wrap up this video, anytime you see AX plus B equals C or AX minus B equals C, you can immediately use this formula. You pick off your three values, plug it in, and you've got your solution. Thanks for watching.